Right, let's go see. Let's go see if they'll do ride-along stuff. That would be cool. Modern day cops. Dude with the GoPro. Put me in that passenger seat. Creek, creek, creek. Gotta oil your backpack there. How's it going? Good! We have a little time to kill. You guys have like a ride-along program? We do. Cool. Tell me the info. I was thinking that would be, you know. Yeah, something to do. Yeah, well people love the police and we've like, we did like farmer's market and we're doing, you know, random like, no editing, just real life as it happens and people love it. People love it more than paddleboarding. So I was thinking, <laughs> you know, put me in the passenger seat. It would be a fun thing and I can, um, justify it if I can film. Yeah, for sure. I assume there's probably some sort of like. Yeah, so basically we have to run a quick background check on you, make sure it's safe to have you in a cop car. I would hope so. Make sure I'm like a U.S. citizen or something, maybe, or I don't know. Well, seriously, you don't have a criminal history. Yeah. You don't have like an FBI number kind of a thing. Well, if I have one, I want to know what it is. Yeah, no. <laughs> Pretty sure I'm good. Pretty clean. I mean, I'm actually pretty clean on those too. Yeah. The last one, I got a bunch of left turn tickets in California when I lived down there because it's like, uh huh. Well, no, it's the uh, like there was one that I didn't see because the median was like poorly marked, oh. and then there's one that was uh, after I got laid off from my job. Um, it was like a time dependent one. So I used to always go to the store at like 6 PM. And then because I wasn't working, I went there at noon and took a left turn, a police, uh, a motorcycle. Time. Yeah. It's like the noon time, which makes sense. Cause it's a busy one. But I was like, what do you mean? I always take a left. Besides the last three vehicles have been Prius van, pickup truck, and then even pickup truck, and then I think maybe a Volkswagen bus. So I don't exactly drive sports cars. Okay, you're not drag racing down, downtown? No, I mean, now that there's only one stoplight. <laughs> the roundabout. The roundabout. I saw a fire truck have to back up the, like yesterday, because it went to go around and then had to stop and back up. They would have measured it. So and I was like, are you kidding me? Yeah, I was like, this is not. I mean, and then the car in front of me I'm started to back up and I started to back up. Right now. Isn't I it cannot, so cute? I cannot stop. I love this. I love it too. I let I, mommy put it in. I love it. You're very distracting. Very distracting. It's true. So I feel like you're talking at me. I'm just like. Well, people do. They give me like super sweet smiles and you're like, <laughs> hi. Oh, wait, that's not for me. I'll Aww. take it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, it'll ask you for some of your basic information and then permissions for us to run you through the database. Yep. That kind of a thing. Make sure you don't have any warrants, all that Of course. Stuff. Um, and then a sergeant will look it over, run it, and then schedule you. Cool. It's basically. like, what, like an hour or two or something yeah. like that, probably? Okay, perfect. Yeah. Definitely. I was like, yeah, with all the kid time, you find these like yeah. hour or two. And you can tell them too, like, you know, I only have an hour or whatever in the... Yeah, no, I mean, I'm happy to, but yeah, that's just, cool. They'll run you through all the like caveats. Like obviously if a major emergency comes up, they will just drop you off somewhere sometimes too. Well, good thing we have a bus system. Yeah, and <laughs> it is within the city limits. Like it's yeah, going to be far. Exactly. They'll be like, okay, you gotta go. I mean, that's the great thing with the camera. As soon as things go yeah. like sideways, you're like, oh, well, at least I'm filming. Yeah. This is going to be great. I gotta go now. Yeah, and yeah. with like paddle boarding, like storms would come up oh. and where you'd normally be like, oh man. And you're like, huh, just getting good. <laughs> uh, but uh yeah no totally sorry she distracts me so much um yes i can tell 24 yeah I'm, I'm gonna try and kind of start like a new 
a new thing of trying to get like, you know, because everybody does like public access, but they're kind of like assholes about it. And so I'm going to try and do like not public access, but by being nice about it and asking. So I'm trying to go to like the military base, be like, sure, you can background check me. Let me like get a tour of like, you know. Yeah, if you state your purpose and... Yeah, if you're like, share the information and I'll like, I had a buddy that was in the military like a long time ago and we used to be able to go and like take tours of stuff and they'd like black out screens and you know, and stuff like that. And so I feel like if you give them information and you're like amenable to what they want, if you're super mean and insistent, then like people are going to be like, all right, you get the minimum possible. Being arrested, you couldn't necessarily show their face or any like... Yeah, I'm sure with the ride along, there's got to be some sort of like, I'd be like, let me record, but you can like have the opportunity to redact or there's got to be some sort of collaborative. If it's just for my eyes only, then I can't like justify it. But if there's, I don't expect to just have like. Yeah. Or even like showing your face when you're arrested. Yeah. Or if they're like, stop recording, I'll be like. Evening every day. So that would be a city ordinance for the noise. And KT is going to be your best contact for all things ordinances uh, for how to follow up on it, how to make it stop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Especially if it's late at night or early in the morning. Um, and then if we need to have an officer out to enforce that, um, she would then work with us. Okay. You, is it a neighbor or just somebody driving through? It's, um, it can hear us for a half a mile or more. Uh, so you, you don't know what vehicle it is? No, I can't see it from where I live. I'm, I'm in the trees, but it uh, sounds like somebody using San Juan and somebody using Sims okay. Way. And it's probably the... Back really quick. I'm going to write another phone number on here for you for our non-emergency dispatch line so mm -hmm. that if you hear it happening, and you call this number immediately, you can say, I'd like to make a complaint right now. Oh, kind of that, thing. Yeah, that's doable. So mm -hmm. KT will talk to you about the ordinances and what the rules are. So this is our non-emergency dispatch. Yeah, I probably will happen in daylight hours, my guess. Yeah, but it's a little hard sometimes if you don't know what direction they're going or what they're driving. It's harder for the officers to tell who sure. it is. But if it is that egregiously loud... I can usually tell the direction, so that'll be helpful. And the general area, so maybe, yeah. maybe we'll find out. So yeah, if an officer is then on patrol in that area, they might be on the lookout for it. Mm -hmm. Can't miss it for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thanks a lot. Yeah, you're very welcome. Uh, okay, I reckon that'd be it. All right, there you I'll go. get that in for approval. And yeah. then you've got contact information on it. Perfect. I think, I, yeah, phone number and yeah. stuff like that. I kind of, I don't write with by hand anymore. Everything's like typed. Yep. Wait, you said. That's a seven. My hand is not working or something. I don't even know what to. Oh, oh, that's hers. Oh, yes. So that's yes, yes, contact. yes. I'm sorry. Hers is one number off oh for God, me. You. You know where I go back. Uh huh. <laughs> I see two zero six. Okay, perfect. My so, husband and I have the same birthday. So. Oh really? Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> so, we should like we're part of some yeah, sort of I club. Know, some sort of a weird. Girl. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but that's always like the joke is like, I, you know, that I make is like, oh yeah, when we got married, I told her that she was going to take my name, but then she took the first one. <laughs> hey, tell them no rush, no worries. Like it's all good, whatever. Yeah, I totally understand. Cool. All right, all right.
If you liked it, please don't forget to subscribe below. Don't forget to like and subscribe.